OmniPod 5 unboxing. Okay, uh, welcome to my channel. If you have not been here before, I'm just starting out. Okay, I think I only got a couple videos, but I will be bringing you guys some more. So if you guys don't know about me, I am a, ooh, I'm breaking stuff. I am a type one diabetic, clearly. There is a difference between type one and type two. So here we go with this big humongous box, the OmniPod 5, it is the wireless insulin pump so it comes with this cell phone i wish i could show you the size of mine but it is literally an android if you can see that it's android it comes with this little cute case i guess it's cute because it go with it yeah. and then let's see what else is in here oh they did have the quick start guide i did have the omnipod dash before so I kind of ain't really need to use all of this, but if it's your first time, I would definitely recommend you follow the steps and sign up and get the training. Um, it comes with the charger and the core, I mean the, the brick. It's a brick, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it comes with oh, the 10 pods. So um, each box has five pods in them. Let me open it. So if you've never seen a pod, um, it looks like this. And uh, I will always recommend for me, I always have two on me because it can malfunction. It should not, but sometimes it can. And then if you don't have any insulin with you, it's terrible. So I recommend doing that. Um, oh, the Omnipod 5. I don't know if you guys know of the CGMs, the continuous glucose monitoring systems had to get that out um but this one actually pairs with the dexcom g6 only the dexcom g6 not the uh what's it called the libre uh, when i first was diagnosed five years ago i did have the libre i didn't really like that because every time i poke myself i bled a lot but that's neither here nor there so how about we transition into what i want to show y'all next I'll probably do it in one. Let me get y'all. Let me show y'all the G6. Hold on. On bet. Let's do a quick stance. All right. So. Uh -huh. All right. So the G6, usually when you get, I guess, like new brand new boxes, I recently switched insurances. So they sent me a brand new thing, which is lit. So this right here is the receiver. This little thing here is the transmitter. And these are the applicators and like how you put it on. So let's start with opening the receiver. So this is also like a little phone, kinda, I guess. It's super tiny, like this small, if you can see. Um, when you're using the OmniPod 5, they did say that this cannot be on. Um, this is what, if you did not have the OmniPod 5 or you don't want it to communicate with your Dexcom, um, you can use this. But if you want the results to come to the OmniPod 5, you need the app. So better have some storage on your phone. Um, all right, that's that. The transmitter. And I'm going to do um, where, I, where I put them on. So I'll make another video so you guys can actually see. So it's a little small box. It's hot. So this one's super tiny. This is what goes inside of the sensor. So it'll like read and Bluetooth, all that fancy similar stuff. Okay. Y'all see my roast? <laughs> this one I'm like sit down. I'll be standing up, I'll be flat. Then I'll be bloated. I only have three. Oh man. So this is a technically 30 day supply. I have three of them in this box. Um, so again, you'll get a closer look up when I do apply them, but this is what that looks like. So together you need the um, sensor, the transmitter, 
And possibly if you don't have an insulin pump, then you'll just have the receiver and then take your regular insulin as usual. So, okay, we're gonna transition on to the next because I'm going to actually be putting them on my body today. So, see you in a second. 